This is our Kitsch Hood ice cream maker that we had bought to attach to our KitchenAid mixer. We've used it successfully three times. We followed all the instructions to make sure that it was thawed completely. We never put it in the dishwasher. We washed it by hand and then we let it sit out to dry. Uh, and we stored it away from everything else. And my wife went to get something today uh, to set. My granddaughter wanted to make some ice cream. And this is what we found. Let me get so you can really see down in there. I mean, it, it almost looks like it exploded from the inside. And I mean, that piece there is where I'll here, I'll show you just looking. I'm not even going to pull it. But look, that's a piece of the metal on how crappy this is. This is the ice cream attachment for the KitchenAid mixer. It's very easy to use. It line attaches just like the bowl does. And then you put the paddle on the inside and then this little attachment just goes like over where the beater would normally go and there you have it i'm using the recipe for the french vanilla ice cream as you can see right here this product is absolute trash this is less than a year and this is what it's done and it's salt basically with aluminum with no protection so you're basically buying junk here, as you can tell. I mean, it. KitchenAid ice cream maker attachment for the KitchenAid side A, side B. It's supposed to go into the mount, so we'll try side B first. Just a lot. Of Might have a belt with the transmission, but I did. So weird thing is, why is it gray around the top part? Like, Joy, I'm not. No, no. I was oh. just... Like, why is it gray? Something. Where is the gray even coming from? What is Look. this? 